This is the quad that I built, this um, micro quad, uh, a couple of weeks ago. Um, now, this is actually a D4R2 receiver. Um, <laughs> and this is the camera. You can see, nice, nice little camera. Anyway, I haven't wired that up yet. Purely because it's got to come off again, I think, anyway. I've had this come in, which is actually a FreeSky FD800 receiver which apparently is a 500 meter range on it and it does ppm so I'm going to replace it there now I've already bound it and it actually works on 1S battery no problem so I'm going to fit it there I can't believe the size of that hang on, where's my micrometers? or vernier gauges, whatever you want to call them Let's turn it on. So the width of it is 13mm, near enough, by 17mm. I think I paid about eight, I paid eight quid for this. <laughs> it's ridiculous. So that does PPM, so that's going to go into the nose, which is underneath totally bloody covered by that thing. So I'm going to fit that. That's fitted. It's all fitted. Receiver, uh, Afro Mini on there, and that camera, I can't remember what it is, but I'll put the link, uh, or I'll put a description here, or there, don't know where yet. Now I was going to weigh this, so, it's <laughs> but it won't even show up on my scales, it's less than a gram. So, and it works. Um, the only thing it doesn't do is telemetry. It's a bit wonky. It doesn't do telemetry. Um, but apart from that, perfect. I mean, for around the house and stuff, you know, it's absolutely fantastic. So this thing is now lighter than ever. I don't know what the weight is. I don't really care. It flies perfectly, you know. Look at that, fantastic, there you go, job done, oh I forgot to add, I don't know if it does the EU protocols for the Tyrannis, um, I'm not using it, the EU thing, because I don't like the EU, because we're not part of, well we are part of it, we won't be, but anyway, whatever, I don't like anything that comes out of the EU, so, sod it. Uh, it works in my Tyrannis, which is an older firmware in it. So there you go, it works.